Hi friends, it's Deanna here today. And today we are back with another top five patterns. Today we're gonna talk about my top five favorite baby patterns. These are perfect for baby gifts, um, whether it be a baby shower, whether it be your own baby, whether it be a friend's baby, whoever it is, or even to sell at your small shop or whatever. Um, these are so perfect for babies and I am in love with every single one of them. So let me tell you what they are and let me give you a little description of them so you can go and grab them from the website. All right, let's get this party started with the baby sleeper gown. Um, this is probably one of my favorite patterns to make. Um, I feel like it is so simple, but yet super cute, especially when you pick those really, really cute baby fabrics sends it over the top. I am obsessed with this pattern. The great thing about it is that you don't have to worry about, you know, what if the baby's really small or anything like that because it is a sleeper, um, like a gown sleeper, so you can have that extra room there if the baby's really long or whatnot. I love that you have the option to make it intricate, 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 intricate and do the snap front which is super adorable, but you can also omit the, the snaps and just do the regular uh, solid front. This pattern comes from size newborn to nine to 12 months, um, and it is adorable. I love the elasticated bottom. It is so simple to do, and I think that sometimes uh, it looks a little bit more difficult than it is, but it's super simple to do. Um, the really cute thing is that, the really fun thing is that it is, if you just do the straight solid option and with the sleeves, um, it takes you like no time to sew. So I, when I've like remembered, oh my goodness, I have a baby shower coming up and I have bought nothing, I don't wanna go to the store, let me make one of these little, and they are so quick. And every time I've made them, my friends love them. So this one is one of my favorites. I think it's adorable. And it also comes with a little baby hat. How cute, it's a reversible baby hat, it is adorable. I think the whole thing together, it just screams perfect baby shower gift. All right, sneaking in at number two is the Good Baby Rumper. This is another really cute one. Um, it's got an envelope sleeve uh, neckline, so it kind of goes right on top of each other, kind of like at the shoulder, so it's easy to pull down. Um, it's got different options for the sleeves. It's got shorts option, pant option, or even a ruffle option if you want to put ruffles on it. Um, and this um, pattern goes from newborn to 4T, so it goes a little bit higher in the um, size range um, because I know even kids that are 40 love to wear these kind of rumpers. Um, it is super adorable. It is a solid front, so it's it actually is a very easy to sew pattern and very quick. So sometimes I'll grab together and make a, a baby gown and then I make, like I make the baby gown little and then I make the good baby rumper just like a size or two bigger so that they grow into it. To me, it's kind of like one of those that kind of grow into, but they can also be worked as like little jammies or something for a newborn. Next, we have the baby bib and bunny ears teether. Now, these are lifesavers. These are so practical and so cute. Every baby needs a bib. Every baby loves to chew on teethers. So this is perfect and they are so cute and super simple. The best part about this pattern is that it's so easy to sew that you can have it done like that. I mean, all of these patterns are really easy, but these two are just super quick. They're perfect for like to throw in that gift bag. They're perfect to just make for your own children, you know, and, and you can make the bib from scraps. You can make it from anything really. Um, you can actually, when you make the bib, there's different ways of making it and you can make it with like a, um, some kind of wet resistant, <laughs> waterproof, I couldn't think of the word, backing, so that it, if it gets all soggy in the front and then the, the back of it doesn't get all wet and doesn't wet their outfits, so that's great. Um, you can make it with a layer of something in the middle that's a little bit thicker to absorb that um, drool or whatever, so that's really, really neat. I also love that you can do the search method where it's just search around the front or zigzag stitch around the front, so you just put them all together and do it real quick, or you can just stitch them together, right sides together, and then flip it and top stitch. 
that's also super quick. And then you have the option of either putting a snap in the back or um, a hook and loop in the back or whatever you want to do to close that in the back. So that makes it really, really simple to sew. And then the teethers, you know what? I think it's a great idea and I haven't done this yet because babies love the crinkly sound and everything like that. So I think it would be perfect to make the teethers with a crinkly sounding material um, right in the middle of the two layers. So you would put it like in the backing so that when you turn it around, um, and you make these little ears, they also have that crinkling sound. Um, you can get like a teething ring and attach it to it, and then you can unhook them off the teething ring and wash them. That's the great thing about it because, um, you know, kids, it's a teething. They're gonna be, it's gonna be in their mouth, so you're gonna wanna wash it. But anyway, this is such a cute and quick pattern for giving away for babies. It is adorable. All right, number four is the beatbox rumper. And you say, why? this is another rumper. You already talked about a rumper. Well, this is a little bit of a bigger step up rumper. This one starts at three months and goes all the way from big kid 14, which, you know, that's almost my size. <laughs> no, not really, but it's a big kid. You know, kids love having those cozy uh, rumpers that they can wear around the house and just play in and get dirty and they don't have to worry about things riding up and everything. This is perfect for that. Um, the bottoms have a little bit of a wider um, crotch area, so they're really super comfortable and fun. Um, there's cuff options, there's different sleeve options, there's even a sleeve lips option, so that's great. And it's got an option of a hood or a neckband, so this is fun because because they can just go ahead and prop that hood on and get to playing when it's cold outside with a long sleeve. Super cute. Last but not least, it's on the go baby changing mat and the wet bag. Okay, so this is a really another really cool pattern to give away or, you know, obviously if you have children, it comes in so super handy. Um, you know, when you're out and about and your baby's bib is soaked or they wet their clothes or something, a wet bag comes in so handy and this pattern is perfect. You have the two different size wet bags, a small and a large, um, and it's got a zipper pouch, a zipper top, so it's super uh, easy to carry and it's got like a little handle. Um, I love this, not just for babies actually. I have one that I carry with me um, in the car to put things in and then I have one that I, I, I've made a couple that I just stuff things in because it's it's a bag, it's a zipper bag, it's great. And then you can make it with that waterproof material on the inside so the outside doesn't get all soaked when you're carrying something in there. And then it comes also with a changing mat, a folding changing mat, which is great because, you know, if you wanna change your baby's diaper or something like that, you can put that changing mat down. And then if you make it with that waterproof material, you can always wipe it down. And also, if you don't wanna put the waterproof material, it could just be like a little blanket. If you get it soiled, you can always just throw it in the washer and wash it. So it's super handy at all times. All right, so those are my top five favorite baby patterns. Let me know below which one is your favorite pattern of the ones that I just talked about. Do you have another baby pattern and you're like, I saw this one all the time, is a must so it's perfection. Let me know about it below. I hope that you enjoy this and I hope that you go check all these out. I'm gonna add the links below and for every single one of these patterns, there is a sewing tutorial on our YouTube channel. So check those out as well. If you're a little bit intimidated and you say, can I really pull this off? Go check them out so you can see that you really can do it. Please come find us on Facebook and Instagram where everybody's sharing their makes and you can share your makes so we can be inspired by you. And I hope you have a great rest of your day.